Hello everyone, welcome to Vision Learning. In today's video, we are going to learn how to generate video using neural style transfer. But before starting our video, please don't forget to subscribe to the channel for getting notified about upcoming videos. First of all, let's check what is neural style transfer. Neural style transfer is an algorithm that allows you to take the style of one image and apply it to the content of another image. It does this by using a convolutional neural network to calculate the style and content representations of the input image. The style representation captures the aesthetic features of the style image, such as brush strokes or color patterns, while the content representation captures the high level features of the content image, such as the shapes and object, objects present in the image. If you want to learn more about neural style transfer algorithm, you can find the link of original paper from the description of video. In order to use in this project, I have one cat video as content and the serenite painting of Vincent van Gogh as style image. For this video, we are going to use Google Colab which gives us free GPU access for running our model. Let's upload our video and image to the session storage of our notebook. Let's see what we need to do for achieving the style transferred video as you see before. I, I wrote down the steps as you see in the beginning of the notebook, which we will follow for, for writing our project. Firstly, we need to load model. We're going to use TensorFlow Hub for loading model. And then we need to read style image and preprocess it, and then read frame of the video and preprocess it. And after that, apply neural style transfer to the each frame of the video. We're going to repeat this third and fourth uh, step till the last frame of our video and we will save each frame, uh, each uh, narrow style transfer uh, frame as a uh, frame of our new video and we're going to save it by using OpenCV video writer function. Let's check out uh, the first cell of our notebook. We need to import the required libraries for our project. Let's run and see. And after that, we're going to load the model and by using hub.load function. As you see, it is successful. In the processing image uh, part, we have two functions. One of the function is image read function. This function will allow us uh, to, to convert the image style image and frames of our videos to the tensor. And then we will normalize each pixel of the image image, and then we will resize it. Uh, to the appropriate uh, size for giving as an input to our model. Let's run. And next we have tensor to image function. This function will allow us uh, to convert the output of our model, which will be tensor. Uh, we will uh, multiply it by 255 for denormalize it because it will be between zero and one, but image uh, image pixel uh, values should, should be between zero and uh, 255. Then we will convert it from tensor to NumPy array to save it as uh, appropriate uh, format for the image. Let's run uh, this cell as well. In the next, we have reading style image and content video. We will use uh, OpenCV inbreed function for reading our image. We can get 
pass of the image by clicking uh, copy pass which will give us the pass of the image you can do same for the video as well uh, don't forget that the OpenC will read the image in the BGR format and we need to convert it to the RGB format by using CV2 dot CVT color in the style image uh, we in the end use image read function for converting it to the tensor and we have video capture for reading the video of our project let's check last part in the transfer video firstly we defined video writer function and we're gonna save our new video uh, as output.mp4 uh, and we will have 10 frame for per second we also need to give frame width and frame height for uh, the video and we can get it by reading only first frame of our video content video and check uh, width and height of this video after that we can give as an input to the video writer function as you see we have while loop this while loop will allow us to read each frame of our video and then convert it to the rgb format each frame then convert it to the tensor format and resize it by using image read function and then we will use hub model uh, to run our model and give each frame of video and style image and we will receive uh, our neural style transferred frame then we will convert this frame to the uh, from tensor to numpy array and then each frame will be written to our output video this process will continue till last frame of our video let's run it and see what we will receive in the result we will receive output.mp4 file as you see it is already appeared in here and after completion we will be able to download it and see what we achieved okay it is already completed let's click download and see Okay, guys let's open our video as you see guys we received neural star transferred video congratulations and i hope you guys enjoyed this video please don't forget to subscribe and like the video uh, i will share with you the repository and the files uh, you see in this video in the description of uh, our video See you in the next video.